Welcome everyone to our very special bonus class. This is this event is called Business Made Easy. And I'm so glad you joined us. We have a lot of people on here live, and I'm sure there will be a lot more people that have the opportunity to listen to this recording in the future. Um, that's what we're hoping that there's a group of us that are collaborating to make this event happen. And um, this is such a top notch group of leaders that I'm really eager to just to hear from all of them, to hear their stories, to hear what they have to share. And so I really encourage you to have some kind of a notebook handy because you might likely have some questions that come up that you want to jot down. Um, for those of you that are new to doTERRA or new to the curiosity of sharing, um, and then there might be some of you on here that have been sharing doTERRA for a long time and you're going to get some helpful reminders or just some ways of looking at things or explaining things that you haven't thought of before. So have your notebook handy so you can jot down, make notes, put questions down, and then I we will remind you at the end, but we really want to encourage you after you listen to this to circle back with the person that invited you to attend this class um, or shared this link with you and circle back with them and let them know what questions came up or what thoughts rose to the surface after getting to watch all of this. So my name is Carrie Sammons and my husband is Gary Sammons. He's also going to be one sharing with us tonight. We live in Columbus, Ohio. Yeah, there you are, Gary. I can see you on the screen. I need to change this view so I can see everybody. And um, and then we, you will also get the honor of hearing from um, after we're actually going to kind of kick it off with Lindsay. Lindsay Elliott is in Tennessee and that she's a blue diamond leader there and she has a powerful story. She and her husband and family that you're going to get to hear more about that. And then she's going to pass the baton over to Trisha Doran. And Trisha is a diamond leader that's actually not far from us at all, also here in New Albany, Ohio, suburb of Columbus. And uh, Trisha has been such a diligent teacher and sharer, and I love her process. And she's been recognized by doTERRA and for a lot of different things. And so you all are really lucky to get to hear from her tonight. And then she's going to pass the baton to Annette Jukes. Annette Jukes is a presidential diamond in Greenwood, Indiana. And uh, Jeanette and, uh, sorry, Annette and Jeremy and their kids have such a cool story and she comes from corporate America and you're going to get to hear more of what she has to share about why doTERRA from her perspective and then you're going to get to hear from my husband Gary and if you don't know Gary he um, is an attorney and he has I feel like he has so much credibility when talking about the topics that we're going to we're going to focus on here tonight. So you're also going to get to hear all of their personal stories, which is probably my favorite part. So lean in. And, um, and like I said, if there's something that you have a question about that we don't cover tonight, jot that down so that you can circle back with your person and make sure you get that answered. This is meant to be not a deep dive, but really kind of an overview of, um, you know, why doTERRA and let me go ahead and launch my, um, share my screen. All right, so some of the questions that you might have as you showed up this evening is, first of all, the big question that I had in the beginning, which is why doTERRA? Like of all the different products out there and of all the different companies, why link arms with doTERRA? So that is gonna be addressed tonight. And then um, how is it that people actually make money with doTERRA? A lot of us on here love the products, love the oils and really have found that they can't help but to share them. And you're gonna learn kind of the basics of how you make money. There's a lot of different ways that you can actually make money in doTERRA. And then um, it's gonna be addressed how much time would be involved. And could this work for me? That's a question that's a really natural question that all of you might be asking yourselves. And then what would be the next step? If you get through this and you're like, okay, this is interesting. I'm actually more curious than I was before. What's the next step, okay? 
So that's what you can expect as you hang with us for the next little bit. So I'm actually gonna pass the baton right now over to you, Lindsay. Awesome, hey, hey, so my name is Lindsay and like Carrie said, I live in Tennessee. I'm here with my husband and five kiddos and I have been sharing this here for about eight years. And side note, before I go onto my slide, Carrie, have you tried turmeric duo capsules for allergies? Cause it's like game changer when you get them in your system for like a little bit of a longer term. It's been, I mean, my allergies went from, I can't go outside in the springtime to like non-existent. So awesome. just for you, Carrie, <laughs> and anybody else on here that might struggle with them, start taking the turmeric duo caps like on a daily basis. And after a few months, just note your changes. So anyways, but I'm gonna hop into exploring the opportunity and I'm gonna start with you guys with a series of questions. And I really invite you guys to stop and think about these. So don't blow through them. If you've got your note, if you've got your note and pencil out, then go ahead and jot down and write your answers to these. So the first question that we have for you is what would be the best part of running your own business? So do you think about freedom, being your own boss, setting your own schedule? What is it that appeals to you about running your own business? The second question is how do you feel about network marketing? So this is often a hang up for people. And I'll give you guys my example because it actually took me about six months to get over the idea of being salesy. And here's the deal with that. So I had to take me out of the equation because if I asked every person on here, what, if you're happy that someone shared essential oils with you, are you grateful that someone got out of their own way to share doTERRA with you? I feel like everyone in this call would say, heck yeah, I'm so happy that they're my life. And so for us, it's that, you know, it's not about us and we get to share authentically from a place of service. And then this whole, you know, stigma around network marketing really goes away because we have this product that is freaking amazing and people need it. And it is our job to share it. And so I would just encourage you again, think about this question, because if you don't have a hang up with this, someone in your life will. And so just get really clear on this question and what this means to you. The third question, what intrigues you about the opportunity with doTERRA? Have you had a profound experience with the essential oils? Have you seen others have success? And it's, it's, it's allowed you to be curious. So just really think through what intrigues you about the opportunity. And then the fourth one, and I want you guys to really spend time on this one is what would residual income mean to your family? And I love this part about doTERRA because once we truly understand residual income, I mean, it is game on. <laughs> I remember the first time that I really grasped residual income. I'd been sharing doTERRA for about a year and we had our youngest child. He was now seven years old. And he was born on November 30th. And I was like, I'm not working for the month after he's born. I just want to snuggle my baby. I don't want to have to worry about calls. I don't have to worry about classes. I just want to be able to be present with my, with my newborn baby. And, and I was, I didn't, I didn't work that December. I was able to take that December off, but here's the cool thing. I still got a paycheck that December. Actually, I still got five paychecks that December. It didn't slow down my business because I wanted to take some time off. And that is very unique to this opportunity that you're able to just say, hey, here's this season or here's this, this moment that I wanna really just be able to step back and take this time off, but your paycheck doesn't stop. So residual income is beautiful. All right, Carrie, I'm ready for the next one. Another question for you guys is what does financial freedom mean to you? So again, write this down journal it out, have a goal, an attainable goal, but a scary goal, something that makes you feel a little bit of butterflies whenever you set it. What would be helpful for your household finances? Is it you want to have enough to go on a date night with your husband? Because I remember that was a big one for us. We have five kids. So, and when we started, we were, we had three kids. They were a lot smaller, but, but, you know, as we've grown, we have five kids now. And 
I want him to say, Hey, once a week or every other week, I want to get out with my husband. I want to have a date with my husband and I don't have to worry about where are we going to fit that in with our finances? Would it be, you know, you want to take a yearly vacation and you want to have that extra expendable income for that. Maybe you want to pay for your mortgage. What does it look like to you to have financial freedom? And this will change as your business grows, but I encourage you to put um, something practical to what financial freedom looks like to you. So I love this slide. We have traditional job and then compared to authentic direct sales. With a traditional job, we're trading hours for dollars, meaning you go, you work your hour, you work your hours, you get your paycheck. If you don't go and work your hours, you don't get your paycheck. There is a limit on advancement and earnings. You are never gonna make more than your boss, right? That, that's always gonna be in place. You have a limited time freedom. If you want time off, you have to ask. If you wanna go on a field trip with your kid, you have to get that cleared, right? And the really root of this is you are building someone else's dream when you are working in a traditional job. Compared to authentic direct sales, we have true residual income. We have no limits on advancement and earnings. And this I love. So you can start today and you can make more money than the person that brought you in. It's your business. You get to make of it what you want to make of it. Freedom to choose your schedule. This is huge. And then you build your dreams. I love to call doTERRA my dream machine. And I want you guys again to think through this. What, what do you want? If you had time and financial freedom, what would you do? What would that look like for your family? So when we first started doTERRA, I remember making a vision board and I actually resisted making a vision board for a long time. And I am so glad that I got over myself and just did it. But one of our big things is we love to travel. I met my husband in Australia and traveling has already always been something that we've, we've loved to do. And we really wanted to have some time to spend with our family internationally. And so in the summer of 2020, my husband quit his job and we moved our family to Mexico for a year and a half. And it was awesome. It was an amazing experience. It was something I wouldn't trade for the world. Our, the memories we made were just, I mean, it was a once in a lifetime experience and doTERRA gave us that opportunity because without doTERRA, my husband wouldn't have been able to quit his job. We wouldn't have been able to do what we did. And so for you guys, maybe that's not your dream, but figure out what is your dream. And doTERRA is that vehicle that can take you where you want to go. So the next thing that I'm going to move into is why partner with doTERRA. So we are the most tested and the most trusted company when it comes to essential oils. And this is huge. This is one of the major things that sets us apart. Essential oils is not a regulated industry. So we have to know our brand. And doTERRA does not mess around with our testing. And so it allows us to share oils from a confident place. This says over 4.5 million customers. This is outdated. We have over 13 million customers at this point. So we are growing and we are growing at a amazing rate. Um, we are used by doctors and hospitals worldwide. We have record breaking retention rate. 65 cent, 65% is unheard of. So the industry average is 13%. And what that means is once someone orders from you, 65% of them are gonna order from you again. That is massive when it comes to what we do, because that means, again, it's that residual piece that we're able to share something. People fall in love with our oils and they're going to keep ordering them because they're going to make such a huge difference in their lives. And then I love this. Everyone needs oils. There is not one person in your life that can't benefit from oils. So there, the amount of people that can be your customer is, is unlimited, right? We are proven. We are the largest essential oil company in the world. We have a growth rate similar to Apple. We were a $1 million company in seven years. So that just, you guys, you know what Apple does. You know how they stand out from the industry. doTERRA is that in the essential oil industry. We have, this is the optimal timing for, um, for opportunity. So doTERRA, you guys, doTERRA is a startup company. We are baby. We are 14 years old. People are more interested in natural solutions now than they have ever been. People are ready for this and someone is waiting for you to share this with them. We have 120 markets, well, more than that, open worldwide. 
this is awesome, you guys, because this means that your growth doesn't have to stay in the States. You can have an international team. So who do you know that doesn't live in the States? You can get oils in their hands because doTERRA is everywhere. We're privately owned and we're debt-free. Love that about doTERRA. And then our, my last slide is to talk about the caring piece of this with doTERRA. So for me, y'all, like this alone makes doTERRA a company that you're going to want to partner with. Our owners have a huge heart and they've created this amazing company that is service oriented. We create partnerships with growers around the world. We preserve agriculture traditions through co-impact sourcing. If you guys are not familiar with co-impact sourcing, after you get done with this call, please go to YouTube and just search doTERRA co-impact sourcing. You're going to be crying by the end of it because you get to see how they source our oils and how they love on people and how they give back. And it is so beautiful how they do that. We have a nonprofit Healing Hands Foundation, which focuses on giving back. That's another thing. Healing Hands is a whole other aspect of doTERRA that allows not only us to give back just by you know, donating a dollar a month with our LRP, but you can actually partner with Healing Hands and they will match certain, um, certain fundraisers that you wanna do for non-for-profits that you have a heart for. So that's just an amazing aspect of, of doTERRA as well. As you grow your doTERRA business, other lives are lifted. When you purchase oils, y'all, you are helping create jobs around the world. This is not a greenhouse in Salt Lake City where we're just you know, keeping it all right here. These are people around the world, so many in developing countries that are having their lives changed by what doTERRA is doing and how we're sourcing our oils from these small scale farmers in developing countries. Every purchase changes growers' lives and their communities. And you can learn more at source2.com. If you haven't gone to source2.com, that's definitely another place I would encourage you to go. doTERRA is so transparent. And this is really important because like I mentioned earlier, this is not a regulated industry. And so doTERRA wants us to feel super confident in knowing exactly what's in our oils. And so you can look on the bottom of your bottle and you can actually enter in the number on the bottom of your bottle and it will show you the, you know, the GMC, oh, I'm going to forget the, the letters, but the report that shows what, how your, you know, the chemical makeup of your oil. And um, it's just a really cool thing to be able to see. So, you know, the more you learn, about doTERRA, especially when it comes to this piece of it, the more you guys are gonna love them. So I'm gonna pass this over to Trisha now. Well, hello everybody. My name is Trisha Doran. I am in central Ohio and I am a diamond and also a North American wellness founder in doTERRA. When I first started, and these are questions that you might be wondering as well, could this work for me? That's what I was wondering when I went to my first class because I saw the need. I had a number of people in my mind that could benefit from what I was hearing. And I thought, could this work for me? But I took a moment to see and to evaluate, well, could doTERRA work for me? And the resounding answer was yes. Ultimately, what came down to it at the time was support. I knew that when I joined doTERRA that I was going to receive support. And that is the hallmark of what doTERRA is all about, supporting communities around the world as we partner with these farmers, supporting wellness advocates as we support our customers. doTERRA is all about support. And in the last, I started in 2013, and in the last several years, I've grown to not only appreciate the support, but their relentless pursuit of purity, their integrity, their immense generosity in giving back and so much more. So if you are passionate about oils, if you care about people, if you can follow a system and get things done, this is right for you, but I'm going to go through these a little bit at a time. See, when I first was approached by my friend, Laura, I could see that she was passionate about oils. She actually still is. And the oils led her to share with me. We often tell people to have fun with their oils when they get them. We're like, have fun with them. Take the bottles, open them up, smell them, use them. And that passion grows as we continue to use them and experience them and have those stories. So here are some questions for you, your passion um, temperature thermometer. Are you using your oils? Are you having stories that 
you're telling people about, oh my gosh, this worked in this way or in that way. Um, how about the consumables? Besides the oils, are you using doTERRA's consumables? Are you swapping out those products that you used to buy from the grocery store, from Costco? And are you using what doTERRA has to offer? They are far better quality. They have the oils in them. Are these products becoming part of your day-to-day -day lifestyle? Because if they are, if they are your go-to when something comes up too, then my friends, you've got passion and we can move on to caring about people. So let's talk about people. We want to demonstrate care. And I don't know about you, but when I, when someone lends me their ear and I have a chance to just talk about whatever is going on in my life, I feel cared about. So when you are sharing oils, if you don't care about them, they're not gonna care about the oils. Um, look at people, listen to them, ask them questions, and that'll give you a tip on how you can share with them. If you listen first, then you can introduce the oils later. Walking into them with a sales pitch is all about you, doesn't fly. But walking in and demonstrating care gets their attention and it really develops that relationship that doTERRA desires in how they do this business. So put yourself in other people's shoes. Think about what would benefit them if they were using oils and look for an opportunity to provide that introduction to them. So my friend, my college friend, Laura, knew about me. She knew that I was into natural health. And she, I remember her texting me and saying, these oils would be so great for your family. I think your guys are going to love them and find great value for them. She invited me to a class and I'm glad that she cared enough, kind of like Lindsay said, she got out of her own way and she knew that these are oils that I was looking for and didn't even know it. And she invited me to a class and you know what? I didn't go. She invited me to a second class. I was too busy. She invited me for two years to go to a class. And finally I had the opportunity to attend a class. And so there, there's a lesson learned there. It's never too late. Be persistent because if you're being persistent with caring then they will come so just like i talked about saying do you have these products and these oils as part of your lifestyle is caring about people part of your lifestyle because if so this business is perfect for you how about getting things done can you follow a system and get things done the beauty about this business is that you don't have to recreate the wheel you don't even have to understand how the wheel works. You don't have to know the chemistry about all the sesquiterpenes and monoterpenes and all the things about the oils. You just need to know that they've worked for you and you can share from your own experience and you can be led and um, guided through some very simple ways to share and to grow. They're very duplicatable. We share and um, the, the oils take care of themselves and we provide, doTERRA provides such amazing mentorship that this business can work for all walks of life and for every generation. We are here to support one another as we are doing this business. Okay, next slide. All right, why direct sales? I have um, often heard, and it makes me so sad. I've often heard people say like, I don't wanna buy from a, an MLM or network marketing because someone at the top is making money. And I had a friend, well, I still have this friend, her name is Kate. And I heard her describe to someone once that every human organization is shaped like a pyramid. Everyone, not, not just corporations, not just, um, doTERRA, but every corporation, every human organization, if you look at our government, you have someone at the top, you have people that support them, you've got a cabinet, you've got a Senate, you've got people below. If you look at a sports team, you have a head coach, you have assistant coaches, you have managers, you have trainers, you have the, um, the starters, and you have the people that are second string, and then you everything is shaped like that. Churches, pastor, you've got elders and deacons and um, people that congregants that go to the church. So when someone tells me they don't like the shape of a pyramid, I ask them like, well, where do you feel comfortable shopping? And a lot of times they'll say, oh, you know, like a grocery store or, or Costco or Whole Foods. 
And I'll remind them that there is someone at the top that doesn't know their name, that is earning money from their purchase. And they're buying things that aren't nearly as quality and aren't supporting their health as much as doTERRA. And they're buying things for 10 cents per off per gallon when doTERRA gives you back 30%. It's really um, a no brainer when someone's open to learning about direct sales, they see the beauty in it. Because when I was introduced, I was so thankful that someone took me by the hand and guided me into learning how to use the oils and then also how to share. So I, I didn't mind that my friend was earning a couple of percent from my order, she was providing so much value to me. So direct sales has a built-in business model. They have a built-in education system and they have low startup costs. When you have this built this business model, we are here to guide you. The product sourcing. I've had people tell me actually, when I'm talking about oils, they see the passion and they're like, you could grow your own oils. And I was like, ah, uh, you don't know what you're talking about. Um, because the way that this business is run, the product sourcing, the fulfillment of orders, the billing, the customer service. The, we don't have to carry inventory. We don't have to worry about shipping. We don't have to worry about overhead requirements. All of that is provided for us. And then we have a built-in education system. We have product knowledge, business trainings, leadership development. We have a community of support that is beautiful. In, um, it's, I think it's unheard of. It really is quite beautiful. And then low startup costs. So think about this for a second. If you've fallen in love with the product because you have a passion for it and you're swapping out the things you used to get somewhere else to get a better product and better return and more, um, more support for your health from doTERRA, then you are already qualified to earn an income. With doTERRA, they, how can you share a product that you don't use, right? So doTERRA says, if you could just order 100 PV a month, will make you eligible to earn income. Quite frankly, my family orders close to 500 or more every single month, because why wouldn't we? We're getting 30% back. I'm supporting my own store. We're gonna talk about how do you make money in doTERRA? Because I think a lot of people, the woman who introduced me wasn't in it for the money, it was the passion for the oils. And a lot of us start out, we almost give away a lot of the stuff. But um, Tanil, my mentor told me, she said, eventually your husband's going to want you to like be able to show some, um, some income or some return for the time that you're spending. So we do make money and you know what? It is residual. Just as Lindsay said, we sample and sampling can look like a lot of things. It's simple. It's actually just an extension of your lifestyle. When I'm helping someone get started, I'll tell them, hey, make sure you always have an oil in your pocket so you can pull it out and have a Calgon moment at any time. Well, that same oil that you're using for yourself, you can allow somebody else to sample. I highly recommend having wild orange and peppermint nearby because those two are very, very easy to sample. And if all you have to do is, um, if all that you can do is open up your bottle and let them smell it, smell it. they've just sampled an oil. So when I'm meeting somebody, I'm kind of listening to them and seeing what they have to say. And one thing I've always prayed about is, Lord, build this business. Help me to make connections and build this business lest I do it in vain. And when I'm talking with someone, if they mention that they have a headache, you know what? God makes sure that I have a past tense near me, or I always seem to have a product near me that the person I'm talking to can benefit from. So keep some products near you. If, um, and then when you're talking to them, you can just simply ask like, Hey, I'm really so sorry that you have a headache. Are you open to trying natural solutions? Or are you open to trying oils? I've got one right here. Do you want to try it? They can, it's, it's so easy to just, um, to ask permission. And we talk about how the oils are empowering and empowerment means being able to make your own choices. So ask that question. Are you open to, because they're going to feel empowered telling you, yes, I am. And then go in with the oil. So they could simply smell it on the bottle, or if you have the opportunity with the peppermint, the wild orange or something else, let them experience. I like to say, do you want to have an oil experience? Put it on their hands, rub your hands together, breathe it in, put a little bit on your tongue, rub it on your neck, let them experience it aromatically, topically, and internally. And when they pause and they realize, wait, this is, 
different. This is kind of cool. And you've got their interest. We're always inviting them to the next step. And the next step is learning more. Are you open to learning more about these? And when they say, yeah, I, yeah, I am, then give them options. I have found it helpful to give two, not 16, not leave an open-ended question, but two options. Great. Are you open to learning? Are you able, are you interested in learning online or in person? And they say online. Great. Would you like to attend an online live Zoom class or watch a recorded webinar? Or if they say they want to get together in person, would you like to get together at, at our next event, uh, group event, or would you like to meet up one-on-one? Um, -on -one? So give people choices so that you can connect with them in the way that resonates best. And as you do that, they're going to start to write down things. These are things I'm interested to learn about. And that will help you guide them into how you can get them started. Usually a couple of kits pop up that um, are really appealing to them. And I'll say, you know what, with what you're dealing with or what you're interested in, these two kits are really great. You know, can I tell you, are you open to learning about, are you open to is a great thing. Are you open to looking into either of these two? And of course they're going to say yes. And so you help them get enrolled and then the fun begins. Then you get to help support them. You tell them, Hey, text me when you get your order. I'm going to, I want to um, help you unbox it. You know, let's go through each thing together, maybe meet up for coffee and go through their orders, write down ways that they are going to use them, help them learn how to log into their account, help them understand the beauty of LRP. Like it's amazing. And then help them get connected with your larger community, whether it's online, like in Facebook groups, or if it's at um, uh, events that you have locally. And if you're the only person locally, well, then you're the event. Say, you know what? Let's get together once a month or a couple times a month and we'll like talk about what we're learning. So create that community. Something that I forgot to mention with sampling is that it's nice to have, I often have big bottles, but if you have the smaller bottles or if you have this like little keychain thing, you can pull that out and even send them home with one. And we have sticker sheets. The stickers fit on the little bottles and the big bottles, even the sample ones. So that's something that you can do. If you're gonna mail something, like let's talk, let's say you're talking to somebody long distance. If you're gonna mail them some samples, I highly recommend um, wild orange, peppermint, and then something that appeals to them. If it's stress, maybe adaptive, if it's um, discomfort, maybe um, the deep blue, something else with some information like the essential oils made easy tear sheet that they can follow as they learn. Okay, next slide. So how much time is involved? I often think of walking into a lake. When you are first getting started with doTERRA, you're trying an oil, like you're dipping your toes in. And as you get more comfortable with it, you kind of go deeper and deeper and deeper. And that has been the case for me. I started slow. I have grown slow. And I would rather be slow and steady and solid than to not be slow and steady and solid. So when I first started, I had four children under the age of 10. I was a dance teacher at either one or two studios at the time. I can't remember if I was still at two. And I was directing a homeschool program. Uh, that's the reason I couldn't go to a class for two years. I did not have time to do doTERRA as a business, but I started it a little bit at a time. I did the three to five hours a week. And the one thing that I did was I always made sure I had something to invite people to. Once a month, I would get together and share what I was learning. We didn't have the resources that we do now. So it's even easier now, pick a day and then invite people. So three to five hours a week, you can start to um, earn the, the commissions to pay for your orders. And I highly recommend that you celebrate every single step. You celebrate when you get your first check. You celebrate when you made enough to cover your order because that's what's going to keep you in the game and keep you moving forward. And then as you're doing that, you might find, you know what, maybe I should give up one of those dance jobs so that I can spend some more time meeting with people because it's so fun to do this job. So you may find that you pull back on other things and that gives you some, a little bit more time and availability so that you can continue to share with doTERRA, doing those duplicatable things where you're sharing and then helping people get enrolled and supporting them. So it might be 10 to 15 hours a week. And after you pay for your oils, you might wanna pay for a vacation or you might wanna pay for remodeling your kitchen or adding a, you know, an extension to your house. That's what it was for me. And then after that, 
you're going to be like, you know what? I see the potential to help other people do this. And as you help other people do this, you're going to start to replace your income. So it happens little by little, but no matter where you are, celebrate it and enjoy the mentorship in the community that is here as we help you pursue this business. And I can pass this now off to Annette. Awesome. Thank you so much. That was fabulous. Um, I was really getting inspired by some of the things you were sharing and it's great, great tips for us all. So I get to share um, today about um, how we get paid in doTERRA. And just a little bit about myself. My name is Annette Jukes and we have been, my husband and I, Jeremy and I have been in doTERRA for 10 years. Um, we just hit our 10 year anniversary in April. Um, and when we started in doTERRA, um, I had four children from our, our oldest daughter had just turned seven. We had twins that were three and a baby that was nine months old. So um, that, that is kind of that epitome of a busy mom. And so I just really think about that, you know, people sometimes think they might be really busy, uh, whether you're a busy mom, busy grandma, busy dad, um, no matter what it is, you know, you're just, you know, caretakers that sometimes we feel like there's not enough room in it. But when you hear Trisha's story and my story, you'll realize that there is room and it's just consistent um, effort and being intentional. And it's not a, it doesn't have to be a 40 hour work week to build and create a, a, what you wish for your life. And so, so what I wanted to share with you today was I, how much I love this compensation plan because it is so stable, it's so generous and rewards loyalty and consistency. And I just think it's the best plan out there. And it's very, very unique and different from other models. Um, so first, when I get, as I get to show you um, how we get paid, I am going to share this from a very high level overview, um, the amazing benefits of the compensation plan. And um, this hopefully will give you a, a good idea of how we get paid. So I'm going on um, to the next slide that you can see a little bit better. Um, so this is where we get into the ranks. And at each rank, there is an average monthly commissions. And I know the screen might be a little hard to see. But for example, at Elite, the average monthly income is $300. And that is just the average. So there's a range. Um, some might be a couple hundred. Some might be four or 500. And um, there, there's things that do create those um that range some might be who has the power of three bonus which we're going to talk in a, just a, a couple slides away um, but it might be how young is your team did you just hit that rank because when you just get started into a rank your team might be a little smaller but as you you go you will find that it will continue to grow and you'll be at the higher end of that range and what's interesting is as soon as we feel like we're at the high end of the range, there's, there's a good chance that you might be ready to rank advance. So that's just a, a note. If you're on the higher end of a rank, look out um, that you might be ready in within reach of rank advancing. So another thing I know that um, was touched upon earlier is that we all have an equal opportunity. So um, we reached uh, the presidential diamond rank back in 2017, but what's very interesting is when I started, there were people above me that were already, you know, I was brand new and they were already at diamond, you know, or at silver and I was just getting started. And what's interesting is I took the path um, because I wanted to create financial freedom and time freedom that I really set intention and put it effort in the um, time investment of resources and consistence and diligence to, to shoot for goals. And so even though we're presidential diamond, there's people above us that are elites or, you know, there's a gal above us that's an elite. There's a silver, there are diamonds and there are blue diamonds. So there, that's just showing you that is, it truly is an equal opportunity. And I do love that Trisha pointed out how corporate America is, is structured. And that's where I came from before doTERRA. I was a VP of finance in HR and all I wanted was time freedom. I had financial freedom, but I wanted time freedom. And I looked at these people all across the organization that were working in the factory, 
pouring their blood and you know like their sweat every day in that factory working on building the the products and um they probably had the hardest job they probably worked the longest hours and i know that they were never going to get paid more than their manager and likewise the manager probably was never going to get paid more than the director and i knew where i was that unless I owned the company or was the president, I probably wasn't going to outperform the president or the owner. So, so there goes to show you that in corporate America, again, I'm just affirming, uh, confirming that that is so true that there, it, there's kind of a, a structure there that once you hit a ceiling, you're stuck. And that is not the case in doTERRA. So you can see as you grow, you unlock that next rank. And it, with ranks, you get more bonuses. So it's just super cool that we have the opportunity to shoot for what we want to do. And it doesn't matter if somebody else has a different goal than us, it's all us, like, and we're free to choose. So I just love that. I love that freedom. Okay, and then moving on to the next slide. Okay, this is where we get into some of the upper ranks. So now we're we're going looking at gold up to presidential diamond, and you know gold that you can see is an average of four thousand seven hundred and eighty dollars a month, and that is a great place to to shoot for if you wish to replace an income. A lot of people make around that range, and if you're looking to replace an income, gold is a great goal to set. If you're looking at duplicating your income, then you can shoot beyond diamond and above. So you can see there's um, at different ranks. Um, it's very neat to see the kind of jumps that you can you can achieve by shooting for that next rank. But again, it's it's completely um, up to you, and we have the ability to choose what we want to invest in in our own personal businesses. And there is a quote that David Sterling says, and a lot of people have said this said this from the stage. And the quote is, "People tend to overestimate." what they can earn in the short term and they underestimate what they can earn in the long term with doTERRA and i believe that is so true and i know that was me when i started um i felt like i was working so hard to achieve that first thousand dollars a month in doTERRA and i wanted so bad to walk away from the corporate i just wanted to just be a free person I guess, you know, completely free, free to choose when I worked, how I worked, how long I worked, and free to have the no glass ceiling. So, um, so I worked so hard to reach the thousand dollars a month. And I think I was like a premier slash silver, like a really weak silver at that time. But, but what was really interesting to me was I kept at it. And I just kept at it. And exactly one year later, we hit $10,000 a month. And the cool thing is, is that it didn't require anything different from what I was doing to hit the first $1,000 a month. It was just keep going, keep going. So, so just keep moving forward. Um, so it's very neat. And then, you know, sometimes people hit a rank and they hit their goal and they want to take the foot off the gas pedal a little bit you know, because they've achieved their goal. And that is our, we have, have that freedom to choose when we want to take the foot off the gas pedal. And I've done that time and again at times. Um, and then there's times I want to rev it up again. But when we have had, uh, we had our son, Thomas, um, I took the foot off the gas pedal. When we decided to homeschool our children six years ago, I, I really shifted there. And the beauty of it was when we did that six years ago, even though I took the foot off the pedal a little bit, we were still able to advance to presidential diamond like the next year. So, so it's just unbelievable what doTERRA has presented to us all that we all can do, you know, can, can grab uh, lock arms with doTERRA and work towards achieving our dreams. So next um, slide is one of the fun ways we earn. And this is the fast way. This is right away. This is what is just the, creates the aha moment I feel for many people. I know for me, it was where the light bulb went off. Um, so when I got introduced to doTERRA, I was just a user and I kind of 
really liked it. I love the oils, but um, I was like, no, I, I'm, you know, I've got a, an income and I just didn't really see myself doing doTERRA. But I really love the product and I love the gals I knew in doTERRA. The, the gals um, that introduced me to doTERRA were in my church and I loved all of them. Um, but when my, what happened was my aunt came to town, she was in um, town for my sister's wedding and she had a headache and I had just got my little family physician kit like a month or so before and her headache just wouldn't go away. And she'd taken ibuprofen like throughout the day several times. And she said she had maxed out. She couldn't take anymore and she still had the headache. So out comes my little box and I just felt like so empowered. And I remember like, like having her lay down on the ground and applying the peppermint to her temples and the lavender to her temples. And within a few minutes, she said her headache was gone. And that was when she's like, how do I get these oils? And um, I've heard Lori Voss's story. Hers is similar to mine. My, my answer was, I really don't know. So let's call doTERRA. So I looked up the doTERRA's phone number and we called the 1-800 number. And my aunt decided she wanted a kit and she wanted a kit bigger. She wanted a one up me. So she went for the home essentials kit. And without seeing it, she just knew she wanted the big, you know, to go one up. And so she got that kit in the next week, I got a $40 check in the mail. And that seriously, like what I said was when the light bulb went off. And so when you see this here, that is the 20% of what we get whenever we share doTERRA. And doTERRA automatically pops the check in the mail, you know, and later on, if you want to do direct deposit, they do that too. But that 20% is super fun at the beginning. And I think it's what creates uh, the realness. It makes this seem so real. If some, if you enroll, say my aunt Shirley enrolled someone else, um, I would receive 10% of that. And she would get the 20% because she introduced the person. And in this, you have Amy and Joe there. But if, if again, that goes down another level and that, that second person introduces it to some, some uh, introduces doTERRA to someone else, um, you, that person will get 20%. Here on the, on the chart, 10% would go to Amy and you'd get 5%. So um, this is a really great way because then it becomes passive income at that point. And fast starts are just a really great way for new builders to get started and get income to reinvest into their business. And when I started to really grow doTERRA and teach classes, uh, especially during Diamond Club, I kind of took, I took my eye off personal enrolling and I was just helping teach for others. There were times that my weekly fast start was four to $500. And that was through just the sheer 10% part and the 5% part. So that was without even enrolling because people I had enrolled were also enrolling people then. So that's just uh, one another way we get paid. And now moving on to the other slide. Let's see, power three, yay. So power three is a structure bonus. And this gets paid every single month based on how we place our team, how we place our customers when they enroll. And each team you can see here, um, if you have somebody and you place three people on your top line and they order over a hundred each and you plus them totals to 600 OV, you'll get a $50 bonus. If you help your team, your leaders do the same thing, get three people on their top line each, you'll make $250 a month. And if you repeat that one more time, you'll make $1,500 a month. This is incredible. It is something that really keeps our structure strong. And it's really, once you build it, it's hard to break. It's really, once you build it out and, um, and you help others to build theirs. So um, I will tell you that there's a, there's a leader on here that she, she, teaches power three so strongly because it it so dramatically shifts an organization and it really helps everyone um keep their income strong so like for a new like an elite who earns a 250 they pretty well double their income with this bonus 
And for a silver who makes 1500, they're approximately doubling their income. So it's a great way to really increase your compensation by just being intentional with placing customers and placing people that you wanna lock arms with. And so moving on to the next and the last, okay. And this is where it really gets exciting for people in doTERRA if you choose to partner with us in doTERRA. On this chart, it's, there's a lot of numbers I know, but it's really pretty simple. Depending on where you place customers or where they land on your tree, the lower you go, the higher the percentage. So that's where it's at. So on your first level, you make 2% on their orders, but by the time you have customers down on your seventh level, you get 7% off the, those orders. And the, the opposite is true for most direct selling organizations. Most direct selling companies do the opposite. They pay you higher on your top level and they go get, pay you less the lower you go. And I will tell you that if that was the case, our income would be drastically slashed because the highest amount of income we make is from Unilevel. And when I first saw these charts, I thought, wow, that just seems like incredible. How could that even be possible? $22,000 off seven levels, off on a seventh level? It just seemed absurd with the numbers, but I will tell you there are many people in doTERRA that make this kind of income. And, um, and it's really cool. This here is based on if the exact three people on each level shared with three people and each of them ordered 150 PV. That's kind of the structure here that they're showing it in a perfect world. And most charts aren't that pretty. Most kind of go out. And I know um, ours isn't that perfectly shaped like a Christmas tree, but it, it matches up very closely to what this is explaining. And um, it's such a beautiful way that doTERRA rewards um, us generously and it keeps our structure so stable. Um, and I know early on they talked about the 65% retention rate. So say you wanna take the month of December off because you wanna celebrate the you know Christmas. Well, because of that 65% retention rate, these numbers stay intact if they're built. So that's the beauty of doTERRA. And, um, and when I first got my first Unilevel check, it, the very first one, it was $4.44. $4.44. And I hope everyone can go remember back that first check. And when I got it, I was super inspired. I was like, this is the beginning. This is the beginning. And sure enough, it was. So, um, so I just want to reiterate how blessed we are to be in doTERRA, that this is one of the most amazing compensation plans out there, that it rewards consistency, loyalty, not only for loyal customers, but loyal builders that are consistent and stick with it and keep going. And, um, and, uh, and also we're truly blessed to be part of this doTERRA community with Carrie and Gary and Trisha and Lori um, and Lindsay, like all the people that have put their heart into the continuing ed series. I'm super thankful for that. So moving on, last but not least, Gary is going to close out the night and he's going to provide some really awesome insights into the leadership performance pools. Awesome. Thanks so much, Annette. Uh, that was awesome uh, explanation of the comp plan, which can be very challenging at times. Um, and everybody's done well. Guys, I'm the last person who's gonna to get to share tonight. I will make this as brief as I can, but I wanna include the power. So the purpose of this slide, this is really the last piece of doTERRA's compensation plan. By the way, Gary Sammons is my name. I am Gary Sammons' husband. You'll get to know me in my story in a second. Um, this is the last piece of doTERRA's compensation plan. I will not go into it in any detail. It's simply, it, think of this as profit sharing, okay? So as doTERRA, does well, we all do well. The leaders within doTERRA uh, do well. And what that creates, it's first of all, it's very cool that doTERRA does that for us. And they view us truly as partners with them. But the other cool thing about that is the culture that it creates. Um, it helps to foster uh, a culture within doTERRA of sharing and us all working together and collaborating. I mean, there are people all across 
various teams just on this call alone. We work with cross line, up line, down line. And uh, I remember the first doTERRA convention that I went to, I was working as a full-time uh, attorney in, like Annette in, in corporate America. And um, my wife was doing doTERRA. So I'm gonna go to convention and see what this is all about. What I experienced, I'll never forget, is something I had never experienced before. It was completely different than the culture I came from. It was, it was that sharing, caring culture. I mean, people were uplifting and supportive and encouraging. Uh, it was inspiring. And I'll never forget that. And I have to continually remind myself of what I came from because it was not that way. It was, it was you know, it was competitive. It was, um, I remember too, sitting in an interview, um, not an interview, I'm sorry, a job performance review with my manager. And he said, you know, Gary, um, one critique of you uh, is that we need you to, to compete more. You need to compete more in your job. I'm like, who am I competing against? Like, well, aren't we all part of the same team working towards the same goals? And uh, it just wasn't really my, my vibe. Now, nothing against jobs, nothing against corporate America in general, but if you can relate to any of that, um, I think you would find the culture um, within doTERRA to be much more pleasant. I certainly did. Um, so I will leave you with that for this slide. Let's move on to the next slide. So planning for the future. Um, this I'll Take this in just for a second before I share what it is. So see if you can make sense of it, then I will. On the left is kind of the typical job scenario. Uh, I think we can all relate to. You look at, you know, I'm making 51, 9, 39 today. In 10 years, you know, with my 2 to 3% raises, I, I hope to be at 67. And there's nothing wrong with that. That's honorable. Uh, God honors that. Um, but if you're wanting more, or, and Annette shared on this a lot, and others shared on this too, if you want to kind of take control of your future, uh, there is incredible um, growth potential with doTERRA and you have control over that. Uh, in the scenario on the left, you don't have as much control. Certainly you can work hard and get promoted, but um, you, have, you have less control over that as well. And there's certainly limits to that as, as Annette explained. But on the right-hand side, um, it, is, it is fairly limitless. I remember sitting, uh, so after I came back from that, actually it was our, my second convention. I came back from convention, I'm sitting at my desk as an attorney working for Nationwide Insurance right down here in downtown Columbus. And um, I had just come back from convention. I'm all jazzed up because I loved what I saw. Uh, I loved the owners. I loved everything about it. I'm sitting down Monday morning, uh, going through my emails and uh, you know, there's a rush order on a, on a, a legal opinion that uh, one of the executives needed. And so I'm, I'm rushing to get that done. I'm you know, starting my rough draft on that opinion. And thinking to myself, you know, I, I could keep doing this um, for many, many more years and make that person rich. Uh, or I could see what I saw at doTERRA's convention, which is people taking control of their own lives uh, and living their own dreams and doing that. So that's, that's the purpose of this slide. And it is absolutely true. Uh, if, you, if you just do the stuff, you will reach your goals. We promise. Um, so that is what's happened to us. We we were able to untether me from my corporate job. I, uh, I guess it was eight years ago. I left that and now my wife and I do it full time. Uh, we are free to um, spend time with our family, with our kids, adventure in ways that I never ever thought possible. Uh, incredible trips and adventures and things we get to do for God and ministry. And uh, it's been an incredible blessing. So whatever that would look like for you, picture it and go for it. All right, let's go. And you can do this at your own pace. Uh, you know, everybody's pace is different. Ours was a medium pace. Some people go at a slow pace. Some people go at a fast pace. You can do this in the cracks of your life. All right. Lori Voss, who's Carrie's mother, is on this call. And she she did it. She was a full-time teacher. And she started doTERRA in the cracks of her life when she had free time, which was not very much. And she eventually became a blue diamond uh, in doTERRA. So that's an amazing story. Let's go to the last slide. So what is the next step? There is a ton of people on this call uh, and a ton of people that will listen to this after this call and everybody's kind of at a different place. Um, but the number one next step for you, if, if something has been churning in your heart, in your bosom, I don't even know why I said bosom. That's oh, funny, I've never said that in my life. If something's churning somewhere, all right, um, take a next step, all right? Don't let this call, the time that you've spent and invested in this 
go. We promise, promise, promise. I, I couldn't be, uh, I couldn't not tell you more uh, how you could not make a wrong decision to take a next step with doTERRA. The best next step you can take is to connect with the person who invited you to this call or to um, watch this recording. If you don't have a wholesale account, get started, get some oils. If you do have a wholesale account, you can uh, can, uh, change to become a wellness advocate. You can talk to uh, a leader or the person who invited you about that. So you can start sharing doTERRA. Um, and then tap into, you know, as Trisha and others mentioned, there's tons of resources available to you. Tap into those resources, talk to leaders, talk to upline uh, support about that to learn more about this business and how awesome it is. And then last but not least, and you'll learn about this, uh, start your list and start sampling. And Trisha mentioned that a, a bit already as well. Uh, that's all I have, guys. Again, you will not make a wrong step by taking the next step. Uh, thank you for giving all of us a chance to share. And I think Carrie's going to wrap it up for us. Wow. <laughs> so good. I'm pumped up, fired up, got something swelling in my bosom. <laughs> that was great. I was laughing so hard. I don't know if everybody could see me, but oh, I was also getting um, teared up. So over and over with every single one of you, all the different powerful things, stories, unique, different experiences that you've all had and the ripple effects. I mean, what, what's, so, what's so poignant to me as I, as I listen in here is I know each of you and I know your individual stories and I know the, the powerful ways it's transformed your families. But what we didn't even have time to touch on is the ripple effects of how many other families, lives and individuals were blessed because each of you were brave enough to share, like Annette, the story of you sharing with your aunt. And immediately she was like, okay, I, this is, where's this been all my life? I need it right now. Like, I think sometimes we get in our own way because we, we stumble over this, like, oh, I don't want to be salesy. I don't want to be my, my friends to like, not want to be around me because I'm talking about doTERRA. But we, um, we get in our own way and we get in our own head when we think like that. And remember, like if you're passionate about a movie that you just watched or a book that you just read that really influenced you or Im made an impact, you can't help but to tell people. And it's the same way with these products. So if you're catching yourself feeling like, oh my gosh, I love these products and I want to tell other people about them, then just be brave and step out and watch what happens and the ripple effects that will continue to grow because of people's lives being impacted with health, better health, non-toxic options, um, and then financial impact, time freedom impact. It just keeps going and growing. So thank you to all of you that shared. I'm gonna go back to the gallery view so I can see everyone. And let's give a silent <laughs> cheer. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. And um, remember what we said in the beginning, whatever questions you have, please reach out right away. In fact, I would encourage you, I'm gonna give you a challenge that if you're on here live with us, go ahead and pull out your phone and text the person that invited you to join tonight and just text them and say, hey, I just got to watch the class and you know, here's a question I have, or let's circle up with each other soon. Um, if you're watching this recording, do the same thing. Just text the person that shared this with you and say, okay, I finished watching this. Let's like follow up with each other. So that's all for tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you to all of you. Enjoy your June, it's almost officially summer. It sure feels like it here. And we will see you soon. Bye. Bye-bye, everybody.